right now, unfortunately. Um, but it's super cute. I'll check out some of the other ones from that line. Definitely the quality is just so good on this bathing suit. It has kind of that fold over seam. So there's no like cutting into your legs or anything like that. Super, super flattering. And I'll put this on for you guys so you can check it out. But I love a one piece because you can wear it as a bodysuit or you can wear it as just a bathing suit, which is super nice. And this one is right under $60, which I think for a one piece is honestly a really good price, especially a quality one that kind of holds everything in. So let me put this on for you guys and I'll show you how I'll style it. Style it as just a typical bathing suit and then also style it if I was to wear it out and about because I think with this, especially this kind of like 70s-esque pattern is super in right now. Um, especially with these colors too. I think it's just so cute for summer. So let me put this on and show you guys. Also, if you do hear anything, the soccer game is playing in the background. So if you hear cheering, that's why. I've also seen a ton of other cute um, one piece bathing suits all over Berry Shop right now. I think they have just a ton of different ones at different price ranges. Some may be a little bit pricier, but I think it's kind of worth it, especially that you can wear the one pieces as a top. And I think more and more so now, people are into kind of that like baggier shorts or pants um, with kind of a cute little like bra top like, which I honestly think you can get away with just like a bathing suit. So here is just this with just the bathing suit, super cute, like I said, fun little pattern, fits very nicely. So this would just be if you're going to the beach, throw it on. I love just kind of a men's button up shirt. I think they're great for these kind of things. And then if I wanted to kind of switch this up to wear it more as a summer top, I'm going to throw on a cute little skirt with it. You can kind of go casual with it. You could throw on some jeans like I was mentioning. I think white jeans or just like true blue jeans would be super cute as well. Um, but I had this skirt, which honestly pulls the color in it very nicely. So here's kind of this outfit. And I think that the colors in the flowers kind of match really nicely with the skirt. It's very cute. Honestly, you probably couldn't even tell that it was a bathing suit. Probably looks more just like a bodysuit. Um, and then also the back is super fun too. It just kind of laces up here. You can kind of adjust it too, which is always nice. And if it was a little too big on you, you can kind of pull it tighter, which is always ideal. And yeah, so that is this one. Um, and then for my last summer top that I I've gone through is this Ghani one, which I am obsessed with. Honestly, love all of their stuff. So I was super excited to be able to get one of their tops, which I think it's on the screen. Yeah. Um, to get one of their tops. I just love their brand. I love how they're kind of more in that street style. I actually recently just got a hat too, so I can show you guys that. But the back of it kind of has this butterfly on it, which I think is super cool. And it's nice too, because you can kind of wear it with a bunch of other colors just because it has so many colors in it, especially if you are spending a little bit more money on just like a t-shirt. I think it's good that you can kind of wear it a lot of ways, which I think this one you definitely can just because it's super simple. Um, so let me show you guys how I will style this, which obviously you can just wear it with kind of simple basic shorts and things like that, but I'm gonna style it more of a street style and then kind of show you how to wear it more casually as well and like i said when you are spending a little bit more money on a, a single item it's definitely nice to have a lot of ways to wear it No, not everyone's into the kind of baggy pants and baggy shirt, but I think when you're kind of going for the street style, you just got to go kind of all in. 
So here is this just oversized t-shirt, super cute. And then I have kind of more of a funky pant to go with it. And I think it looks nice with the butterfly because the butterfly has some green in it. Kind of pull that through and I'd probably just pair it with my dunks just to kind of make it very, very street style like I mentioned. Um, and you could even throw on a hat, which I was just showing you guys, um, telling you guys about. I just got a Ghani hat. I'm super excited about two. Um, so again, very street style, but I'm kind of into it. I think it's a fun, casual kind of running errands outfit. Um, and another way to style it, which will kind of transition into summer shorts is just with my personal favorite type of short is that boxer short that I feel like you're seeing in a lot of places right now. Um, and these ones are just purple, super, super casual with this. And again, with the butterfly on the back, kind of pulls through some color, super casual, super cozy, kind of perfect for running errands, especially if it's super hot outside. Personally, I hate wearing like jean shorts when it's really hot and you're trying to just do a lot of things. I'd much rather wear something like this, a lot more comfortable and also very flattering too, just because they have kind of a little bit of a higher waist kind of sucks you in here and then just a little bit flowier at the end. And I do have a few pairs of these. I actually